Make your own headlines. Hey, this is Dal Welsh inviting you to enjoy some random news and make the grace of God your biggest headline of the day. Today's podcast is sponsored by Larry Mondello's Candy Emporium and the letter T. So what is Larry Mondello's Candy Emporium? Well, Larry Mondello was a fictional character on the TV show Leave It to Beaver. In almost every scene, Larry had food, an apple or a candy bar or something. He was always eating. That kind of makes Larry my hero. Now, does Larry really have a candy emporium? No. But if you're ever in Penyan, New York, you can go to the Cuca Candy Emporium. They got all the candy you want. And it's in the heart of the Finger Lakes. You know why the crab wouldn't share his candy bar? He's shellfish. A big congrats to Terry from South Carolina. He was the first person to guess the identity of this month's sponsor. If you ever want to make a guess, text us at 786-H-O-L-L-A-N-D. 786-HOLLAND. Jesus was teaching a crowd of people one day and said this, Do not work for the food that perishes, but for the food that endures to eternal life. Now, does that mean you should quit your job and go camp out in a tent on a hill outside of Jerusalem and eat nothing but locust and wild honey? No. It just means that all of us are naturally more inclined toward physical things than spiritual things. I can take a bite out of a Snickers bar, but I can't necessarily take a bite out of salvation. But that Snickers bar will not endure to eternal life. But salvation in Jesus Christ... It will. Someone put it this way. Our hunger for food, love, fame, and material things can only be quenched by a stronger desire. What is that stronger desire? Well, your soul's ultimate desire cannot be found at the Candy Emporium. It can only be found in Jesus. So, ask God to give you a hunger for knowing Jesus. He's not shellfish. He's the Savior of the world. Make that one of your headlines today. Make Your Own Headlines is a little smidge of encouragement from Holland Avenue Baptist Church. Listen Monday to Friday and catch our weekly Holland Avenue sermon podcast wherever you listen to podcasts. And for more positive resources, check out hollandavenue.com.